Ellen Harding Casey grew up in Dunmore and spent most of her life as a Scranton resident in the city's Green Ridge section. Many knew Ellen as the First Lady of Pennsylvania, serving beside her husband Bob, who was governor from 1987 to 1995. Her son, Senator Bob Casey Jr., announced that Ellen passed away at the age of 91 after a brief illness. Monsignor Joseph Quinn has known the Casey family for decades and says Ellen was special. Unforgettable and just singular in every way and just uh, filled with grace and graciousness and kindness that marked her life. The Casey family has spent decades in the spotlight, but for many, none of the attention changed who Ellen was. She never ever uh, directed attention to herself. It was always, how are you? It was always asking about your well-being, always asking about your family. And she was as welcoming to neighbors uh, and strangers as she was to the president of the United States. She's, you know, well known in Pennsylvania as our first lady, but she's truly the matriarch of northeastern Pennsylvania for all of us. And there isn't a person who uh, walked away from Ellen Casey not feeling better and proud of their community. The Casey's raised eight children in this house, and it was where Ellen spent her life even after former Governor Casey passed away in 2000. Virginia McGregor grew up and still lives down the street from the Casey house. She spent much of her childhood getting to know Ellen. The Casey household is where everyone went to play, everyone gathered in the morning, and pretty much ended their day because she was so welcoming and open. Ellen Casey was committed to living her life with and for others, whether it was her family or the people of the Commonwealth. Those qualities are what made her a shining light to anyone she met. People will always, I think, just remember her for being herself, not for trying to be famous, not trying to be outstanding. But she was outstanding, and she was famous simply because she was so kind and simple in everything she did. Funeral arrangements for Ellen Casey have not yet been announced. Courtney Harrison, Newswatch 16, Lackawanna County.